Zadie spent 615 minutes reading her first book and 370 minutes reading her second book. How many minutes did she spend reading the two books? Now take a moment to think about what the equation would look like. Did you say 615 plus 370? Well, that is correct. That's what we're going to be solving. We're going to be showing it in three ways. Uh, a base 10 model, expanded form, and then also in standard form using partial sums. So our base 10 model, we are going to use the box line dots to draw the model. And so for 615, my first add end, I'm going to have 600s. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's one ten and five ones. For my second add end here, 370, I have three hundreds. I have seven tens, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and zero ones. Now I can go ahead and add up all of the parts that I have. So my my hundreds, if I count that up, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine hundreds. Nine hundreds. The tens, the ten and seventy. We have one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight tens. And counting up my ones, there's one, two, three, four, five. Five ones. Okay. And now showing it in expanded form, I would write each add end and expand it by place value. Remember to putting the hundreds the, plus the tens plus the ones. So 615 would look like this 600 plus 10 plus five, and we are adding 370. So that would be 300 plus 70 plus zero, as there's nothing in the ones place for that number. And making sure that everything is lined up nicely by place value. So here's all my hundreds, here's all my tens, here's all my ones. I'm gonna go through and do the same thing of adding up each of those place values. So 600 plus 300 is 900. 10 plus 70 is 80 and 5 plus 0 is 5. Notice how that looks a lot like what is over here for our base 10 model. If we're doing it in standard form, so standard form means that we're writing the number just out normally. That's our normal number, 615. And we're going to be writing this problem out um, vertically. So that means we're going to put 370 below it. And again, making sure everything is lined up by a place value. The hundreds are with the hundreds, the tens with the tens, and the ones with the ones. Then we go through and we're, we're going to do partial sums. So doing the same thing, I'm looking at my hundreds. In the hundreds place, I have a six and a three. So that's 600 plus 300. If I add that together, it is 900. In the tens place, I have a 10 and 70. Adding that together is 80. In the ones place, I have five plus nothing, so that is five. And now with all these partial sums, what it, what it means by partial sums is that you have a part of it, right? So here's the hundreds, here are the tens, here are the ones. And so I'm going to add up all of those parts, seeing that now it's 900 plus no other hundreds. 80 plus nothing else, and then five, 985. We just showed um, 615 plus 370, showed in those three different ways, which all of them are very, very similar as they're all doing partial sums, doing um, the sum of the hundreds, the sum of the tens, the sum of the ones, and then adding up all those sums together to equal, boom, 900, eight tens, five ones, 900 plus 80 plus five, which is 985. So looking back at our story context, of how many minutes did she spend reading the two books, we could say that Zadie spent 985 minutes reading the two books.